Hey, all right. I'll shut the radio now. You got the Pumpkin King Indiana here. I'll hop out real quick. That's it. A shitty, a shitty day. I'm down here in the river bottoms in a field of ours. I did a video earlier this year how uh, this had a big sinkhole right in here and we fixed it up. So I drove down here after they got the beans off finally just to check it out and see how it held up and it looks it looks pretty good. I'd like to drive out through the field a little more but I'm in love gun, not my truck. So uh, I didn't feel like getting it out of the garage and it's cleaned up but I want to get it dirty. So I took a chance to drive no love gun down here. A little Coleman car. <laughs> but uh it looks like it all held up pretty good. The interesting thing will be this spring whenever usually you get a lot of water and shit. But we'll just take a little cruise down through here. It's kind of cold out. I'm wearing shorts, so uh right, I'll get in the car and do a little tour. Hopefully I don't get stuck. I don't think I will, but you know, one video where all them corn stalks they were right right over in here you can see they're all gone now I think my dad ended up burning them off or part of them but uh man I'd really like to take off down through there go down by the river too but not gonna happen I'm not gonna chance it I'm already freaking spinning god damn <laughs> oh love god she ain't let me down yet i drive this son of a bitch everywhere and through snow and all and cross my fingers the old bitch has got 210,000 miles on it so that that just came on so i fuck who knows got my little hula girl there but anyways this is another place we fixed. I don't know if it's gonna, I'll pull on over here. You guys see a little better then. It's already washed a little bit. I don't think it'll hold cause the natural, natural direction of the water is right on down that, I'm gonna call it a waterway, but kind of half ass is. Right uh, to that stand pipe and then drains off into the river comes off a, a neighboring field so I think that'll probably cut through there some more my guess my experience there's really not a whole lot you do there instead unless you want to put a wasp cob which a lot of people probably don't know what a wasp cob is you'd like build a dirt mound right around there and put a stand pipe and run a tile down there to that tile and catch that water ideal place would be on the edge of him that way it wouldn't erode us but you could take that out too it's kind of a road so yeah i don't know just my opinion i'll just run a bulldozer but it's a little slick out here there's no doubt but a pretty nice square field we got right here so yeah I'm not sure what the beans made. I haven't talked to the guy who farms it for us. I don't know if my dad has either. Probably he has, I'm assuming. But uh, I have not. You really don't, I don't see the guy much running. So, uh, but looks like the beans are off. I don't know what they did. Looks like there might be, I can't tell if that's a coyote or something. Wait, we'll scroll on. It's just beans. It's not moving. It must just be a little bit of beans. But... Oh well, I thought I'd just do a little follow up video on that. I said it's. I guess it's not horrible. It's 46 out, but. It's cool enough for me. But. Well, that's another in the books here for the Pumpkin King, Indiana. We'll be making up some more videos. I know this ain't got any pumpkins in it, but that season, as you guys all know, is done, gone. So, fill in with some filler till the spring, and I go from there. 
so like rate comment subscribe suggestions whatever uh gopro would be a really nice christmas present for the uh the pumpkin king indiana or something maybe i could mount it on something <laughs> all righty thank you